Al-Mudarris. Are you with me? Al-Mudarris. Lesson number five. Ad-Darslu Khamisu. Do you see Khamisu? Ad-Darslu Khamisu. Or did I say by then, sisters? Ad-Darslu Khamisu. Kha al kha mi su Adarsul Khamisu Al Kha Mi Su. What what kind of a wazan is this? Fa ilun. Wazan is Fa ilun. Remember that. It will help you inshallah. Fine. Al Mudarris. Man fataha babal fasli. Man fataha. Who opened? Opened what? Opened what? Bab al-Fasli. What is Bab al-Fasli? Two words. Mudaf, Mudaf lehi. Huh? Now you see, Bab al-Fasli is Mudaf, Mudaf lehi. And if you want to circle it, Bab al-Fasli, that it is Mudaf, Mudaf lehi, you can do that. Huh? Fine. Brothers and sisters, what is Baba? Mafulun bihi. Sahi. Bahuwa. Mudaf. And Mudaf ilihi. Yeah. Hamid says, Ana. I. Muftada. Where is the khabar? The whole jumla failure is your khabar. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? The whole jumla failure is your khabar. Okay. Ana. Fatah, verb to file who? Mafulun bihi. You got the idea? Fatah to who? How many words are there? Three. Three. Fatah to and who? When uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala asked Iblis, why didn't you prostrate before Adam when I asked you? What did he say? What did he say to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? Khalak tahu. Translate brother. You created him. Sahi? Where is the verb? Khalak. Where is the file? Ta. And where is, what is now next thing? Now, you created him from clay. And he said about himself, what did he say? Khalak ta ni. Khalak ta ni min nari. Yeah, you created me from fire, so I am superior to him, you know. So let us write down that. Khalak. Huh? Ta. Ni Now look at it brother Khalak Ta Ni Where is the verb? Khalak And then what is ta? File Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala And what is this noon doing here? Noon of protection what is it? Nuna protection. And where is the mafulun bihi? Ya mutakallim. Got the idea, brother? Yeah. Huh? Now remove nunu vikaya, the, the verb will get ruined. What will you say? Khalak ti. What will it become if there is no nunu vikaya? Uh, what will happen, brother? If there is no nunu vikaya, it will become khalak. Huh? I'm not writing anything on ta. And I'm putting here. What will happen now, brother and sister? Khalak ti. The noon got, the fail got ruined, brother. Huh? Because we wanted to say khalak ta. Ah, we did not want to say khalak ti. The, the verb is khalakta. And because Ya Mutakalim came, it gave it a kasra. 
So in order to protect the verb, we brought noon. And we are telling Ya Mutakalam, Kitene Kasare Deneh. Ek Deneh, thus Deneh. Yitane Deneh, De do. What did I say? We are asking Ya Mutakalam, how many Kasaras you want to give? One, two, ten. Give as many as you want. But give it to the noon. Don't touch the verb. Don't touch the verb. <laughs> verb is not to be touched. So then, brother and sisters, what is this? Khalak. Verb. Ta. File. Noon. Noon of protection. And what is Yamuta Kalim? Mafulun bihi. Got the idea? So this is the way now we'll be using pronouns. Huh? As a mafulun bihi. So look at it. Ana fatah tu hu. Ana fatah tu hu. So brother, you will break it down. Fatah fiel tu file. Who mafulun bihi. Object. Huh? All the time, if you practice this, you will become very strong. Okay, brother and sister. Man fatahal nawafiza. What is the translation? Windows, huh? nawafiza, plural. Huh? What is the answer? Ali says, ana fatah tu ha. Why ha? Kulu jama muhannas. Kulu jama muhannas. Ana fatah tu ha. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Fiel, file, and mafulun bihi. Very good, brothers. Man kasara hazal maktaba. Man kasara hazal maktaba. A translation, brothers and sisters? Who broke this desk? Fine, brothers and sisters. So, kasara, fiel, where is the file? Mustatir. Where is the file? Mustatir. Where is mafulun bihi? Ah, that is your mafulun bihi. And then what is al maktaba? Badal. Huh? What is it? You got the idea, brothers and sisters? It's wonderful, you know, when you can analyze it and see the how the words are constructed into a sentence. Okay, brother, kasara fial, file mustatir. What is the meaning of kasara? To break. Huh? He broke. Broke what? Haza. Broke what? Haza. He broke this. And then al maktaba became badal for this. Got the idea? Then the teacher is asking, Anta kasartahu ya Hashim? Translation, brother. Kasartahu? You do break it? Huh? See, now the mafurun bihi came. Now the, all the verbs, inshallah, Dr. Sahib will use, are all transitive verbs. Then the mafurun bihi will come. Sahi? Anta kasartahu. See? Kasar. Ta, who? Fiel, file, mafulun bi. Kasar, ta, who? Huh? What is the answer? La. Inni, truly I. What is inna? Harfu taukit wa nasb. And so where is the ismu inna? Ya mutakallim. Okay. So where is the khabar inna? Jumla failia. Are you with me now? The khabar is coming as a jumla. Huh? Inni ma. What is ma, brother and sister? Harfu nafi. Huh? Particle of negation. And what is this? Kasar tu hu. I broke it. Ma with ma is I did not break it. Are you with me? Ma kasar tu hu. I did not Break it. Look at the verb. Where is the verb? Kasar. Where is the file? Tu. Where is mafulun bihi? 
who? Got the idea? Now tell me, brothers and sisters, isn't this easy and wonderful? Alhamdulillah, now you are moving further now. Huh? You are now learning mafulun bihi. And, and this is where the lessons will become more and more interesting, inshallah. Uh, Raja uh, Zakaria. So here Raja is. See here again, Doctor Abdul Rahim is uh, using his, you know, vision. Now Doctor Abdul Rahim is teaching us transitive verse, but then he will also bring in transitive verbs in between to remind us that it does not need mafulun bihi. So okay. A Raja Zakaria wa Hamzatu wa Uthmanu min Makkata. Okay. Raja is fail. Where is the file, brother? And what is this Hamza to? Mautufun ala Zakaria. And what is Uthmanu? Mautufun ala Zakaria. Got the idea? Fine, brother. What is the answer? La. No. Ma. Raja u. What is the meaning of it? They did not return. What is Ma? Harfunafi. Okay, and then where is the fiel? Raja. Where is the file? Wow. wow. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. So that was intransitive verb. <coughs> Abbas. Ya Ustaz. Kharajat tulabul jududu wa zahabu ilal mudiri. Huh? Brother? What is the translation? The new students came out and went to the director. Sahi, brother? We are going to learn now a lot of things in this lesson. See, kharaja tullabu. Where is the verb, brother? Kharaja. Where is the file? Tullabu. Huh? Okay. And then, what is al-jududu? Naat. And then, wow came. And then what is the verb? Zahabu. Are you with me? Zahabu. Where is the verb? Zahabu with Dhamma. Where is the file? Wow. Huh? Okay. Now look at it, brothers and sisters. The sentence started with a verb in the singular form. Do you see Kharaja in the singular form? Where is the file? Tullabu. Now that is a jama. That is a jama. So we are going to learn. Very soon. In next half an hour inshallah. If we can finish it. Otherwise we will do this tomorrow inshallah. So that is why I say this lesson is extremely, extremely important to understand. We won't rush. We will take our time inshallah. Okay. Now Mudaris is asking Talha A fahimta darsa ya talha Translation brothers and sisters O talha Did you understand? Understand what? Are you with me? I am asking Understand what? A darsa So brother Figure out fail Fahim only for him. Where is the file? Ta. Oh, where is mafulun bihi? Darsa. Got the idea? What is the answer? Naam. Yes. Fahim. Tu. Hu. Jayidan. Fahim. Tu. Hu. Jayidan. See, I am deliberately breaking them. Instead of, I can also say Fahim Tuhu. But I'm trying to break it for you to understand. Where is the verb? Fahim. Where is the file? Tu. Where is Mafulun Bihi? Who. Got the idea? What is Jaidan? See, Jaidan, Mansu, Mansu. Mafulun Motlak. <laughs> that we are going to learn later on. So here, Jaidan is Mansu. But there has to be a reason for it to be mansu. It is mafulun, mutlak, but we are going to learn later on. Kataptal ajbibata ya faisal. 
look at this brother katab ta what is the meaning of it did you write write what answers allah ji bata is answers this is plural brother what is singular <coughs> jawab ha huh? singular is jawab ha huh? i will write down here brother jawab un what is the plural ajbi ba tun ha huh? <coughs> now i'll write down one more thing What is this, brother? Sualun. What did I write down? What is the jama? Asilatun. Same pattern. What is the jama? As i la tun. Now I write down one more, brother. Isalun. What is the jama? Amsilatun. Do you see a pattern coming here? What is it? Jama. Amsilatun. See here. Look at it. There is a pattern. Ajvibatun. Asilatun. And amsilatun. اكتبت الاجوبه يا فيصل to you write the answers what is the answer لا ما كتبت ها see كتب تو and then hi what is the translation i did not write them ha huh? i did not write them huh? fine brother and sister the question limaza translation why limaza why lianani what is this lianani because i lianani means because i okay brother so what is this lianna anna is min akhwatu inna okay li is separate anna min akhwatu inna so where is the ismu anna ya mutakallim mansu remember oh, where is the khabar now the whole jumla ha huh? fi'liya is your khabar ma ma fahim tu al as'ila ta what is the translation because i did not understand the questions How can I write answers when I didn't understand the questions? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Look at it now. Ma harfu nafi. Where is the verb? Fahim. File two. File two. Mafulun bihi as ilata mansub. Do you see it, brother? Fine. So here is a nice verb, brother. See how many different verbs are now. We are getting every sentence verb now. A hafista surat al fajri ya Ibrahim. A hafista translation, brother. A hafista. Did you memorize? Memorize what? Surata. What is surata? Mafulun. Wahua. Mudaf. And where is Mudaf ilahi? Uh, uh, did you memorize the Surah Fajr? Uh, ya Ibrahim? So brother, Surata is Mafulun bihi wa huwa Mudaf and then Fajri Mudaf ilahi. MashaAllah. Fine. Okay brothers and sisters, what is the answer? Naam 
Hafiz? No. He's answering himself now. Naam, Hafiz, tu, ha. So, brother, where is the verb? Hafiz. Then, tu. And then, ha. Fine. Wa, Hafiz, tu, suratatini. What is it, brother? Hafiz, tu, suratatini. Translation, brother? I memorized suratin. Now, let us analyze. Hafiz, fiel, tu, fa'il, surata, maful bivi, wa huwa mudaf, and tini mudafili. Alhamdulillah. See how beautiful it is, brother? Now you understand all these things, inshallah. Aidan, this is a maful mutlaq. It's mansub. Huh? It is mansu. Aidan is mansu. Ajib anil as'ilatil atiyati. Aina zahaba tulabul jududu. Aina zahaba tulabul jududu. Fine, brother. Where is the verb? Where is the file? Tulabu. Fine. What will you answer now? Zahabu ilal mudiri. Khalas. Afahimat talhatu darsa fahima fiel talhatu fail ad darsa mafulun bihi did talha understand the lesson now brother ayya suratin hafiza ibrahim this is very important and put a proper vowel sign on ayya Ayyu yawmin haza. What is the translation? Is today. Ayyu shahrin haza. Okay. So ayyu came. Huh? Okay. Now, if I say, Fi ayyi shari'in. Fi ayyi shari'in. Translation? In which street? Huh? Say. Now it comes. Ayya. Now comes Ayya. Write down Ayya, brother. Why it is Ayya? Huh? Why it is Ayya? Huh? Now, I know Ayyu, if it is Ayyu, it is either Muptada or Khabar. Because they are Marfu. Huh? If I say Ayyi, then I know it is Majroor. Now, Ayya... It is mansu. So then it is, maybe it is mafulun bihi. And it is definitely mafulun bihi. Ayya suratin. But then brother, mafulun bihi came in the beginning. <clears throat> because ayya is also used for asking questions. So it has to come in the beginning. Ayya has to come in the beginning. Even if it is mansub, it has to come in the beginning. How do I satisfy myself that this is mafulun bihi? So I, in my mind, in my own unorthodox way, I change the words. I say to you, I say to you, Hafiza Ibrahim. What did I say to you, brothers and sisters? Hafiza Ibrahim. Translate, brother. Memorize. Now I say to you, which surah? Hafiz memorized. Hafiz memorized. He memorized something. Now I want to ask you. He memorized which surah? So then which? Huh? Is the answer to what? Hafiza, Ibrahimu, Ibrahim memorize. Memorize what? But instead of saying what, I say which surah. Are you with me? So what is now which coming as a? Mafulun bihi. Hafiza Ibrahim. Ibrahim memorize. Memorize what? So instead of saying what, I say which? Because I get an answer for that. Which? 
Inshallah, try to understand as much as you can, brothers and sisters. Which surah? So, which surah is mudaf, mudaf ilahi? Because, you know, ayyu will always come as a mudaf. But because hafiza is a transitive verb, huh? then it will come as a mafulun bihi. Ayyu will become ayya. Ayyu will become ayya. I ask you, brother and sister, in English, I want to ask you, which book did you read? Now, first tell me about the, did you read? Or book, which book you read? Which book you read? Translate you read? Karata. Okay. So, Karata you read. Which book? So, which book is? Ayya Kitabin. Are you with me? Which book? Translate which book? Actually, if it is not in the sentence, then you will say, Ayyu Kitabin. Are you with me? Ayyu Kitabin. Now, but you are using a verb. Huh? Karata, karata, needs mafulun bihi. So then you will say, Ayya Kitabin Karata. Not Ayyu. Ayya. Why Ayya? Because now Ayya is the mafulun bihi for Karata. So turn it around, brother. Say Karata first. Just say for the sake of Karata uh, to find out mafulun bihi because it needs mafulun bihi. So you will say Karata Ayya Suratin. I write here, brother and sister. I am changing the, the f- verbs, brother. Hafiza. Ibra he mu okay ah, brothers and sisters Hafiza Ibrahim Ibrahim memorized now are you satisfied with the statement he memorized what did he memorize did he memorize some song did he memorize some poetry did he memorize a verse of the Quran did he memorize the whole Quran? What did he memorize? Huh? So then I say, what will write down now? I need mafulun bihi. Ayya. Heard the idea? It came as a ayya. So ayya needs now mudafilehi. Huh? So I say, Surah 10. Huh? Hafiza Ibrahimu. Ibrahim memorized which surah? Huh? Now, brother, Ayya cannot come like this. Ayya has to go in the front. So it became, brother, Ayya Surah 10. Hafiza Ibrahimu. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Are you with me? I'm trying to explain this because I had a little difficulty in getting this concept in my mind. Why Ayya becomes Mansub? The question is why Ayya becomes Mansub? You cannot say Ayyu. Ayya. Fine. Now look at this very carefully, brothers and sisters. As I was asking you, Karata. What did I say? Karata. Where is the verb? Kara. Where is the file? Ta. You read. Now I say, which book? Read what? Which book? Huh? So I will say, I, ya, kita, bin. 
which of the book? Sahih. Now, ayya cannot come in the end. It has to come in the front. So, how will I write down? Ayya kitabin. Ayya kitabin. If I say to you, which lesson did you understand? Which lesson you understood? Huh? So, because huh, that understood is a transitive verb, Fahima, I must have Mafulun Bihi. Sahi. So, which book means Ayu uh, uh, Kitabin or Ayu Darsin? Huh? But because the verb is transitive, Ayu will become Ayya. So, which lesson you understood? How will you say? Ayya Darsin Fahimta. If I ask you, all of you, which lesson did you all understand? Ayya darsin fahimtum. Ayya darsin fahimtum. So, are you with me? Ayya, if it is coming in the beginning with a verbal sentence, with a verb in the sentence, and if the verb is transitive, then ayya is your mafulun bihi in the question. Now because ayya will result in question. Ayyu huh? kalamin huh? indaka. So ayyu will always come in the, as a question. Now it is coming as a question. Ayya kitabin karata. Which book did you read? Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Inshallah, you will understand. So, the point of understanding, brother, is that you should know if the verb is transitive, then the, it will come as a ayya. Huh? Are you with me? Are you with me? So these are all transitive words, brother. Okay? Then you will have uh, ayu as a ay ya, as a mafulun bihi. So here, third question is ayya suratin hafiza ibrahimu. What will be your answer? Hafiza ibrahimu surat al fajri. Wa surat al very good. Man fatahal nawafiza. Man fatahal nawafiza. What is the answer, brother? Fataha. Ha. Fataha. Ha. And then file. Aliyun. Huh? So, how will you write down, brothers and sisters? You will write down. Okay. Fa. Ta. Ha, ha, Ali, Yun. Man fatahal nawafiza. Mafulun bihi. Man fatahal nawafiza. Mafulun bihi. What will you say? Fataha, ha, fataha, ha, Ali, Yun. Translate, brother. Ali open them. them. Huh? Ha is for them. Fine, Ali open them. Where is the verb? Fataha. Where is the verb? Where is the verb, brothers and sisters? Fataha. Where is the file? Ali. Ali. See, it's there. Huh? And then ha is your mafulun bi. Suppose if Ali was not there, then I will say file is he opened them. But we have to mention Ali in this case because 
We don't know who opened them. So we say, Fataha Ha Alijun. So Alijun is your file. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Hmm? Now, question number two, brothers and sisters, is, is whether the statement is right or wrong. Are you with me? Statement is right or wrong. Okay. Fataha Aliyun Fasla. Fasla. Write down Fasla. Huh? Fataha Aliyun Fasla. Is it correct? No, it is wrong. Fataha Aliyun Nawafiza. Fine. Fataha Aliyun Fasla. It is wrong. Fataha Aliyun Nawafiza. Then, Ma Raja Zakaria wa Hamzatu wa Uthmanu min Makkah. Is it correct? Yes, it is correct. Ma Kataba Faisalun Ajbi Bata Li Annahu Ma Fahimal Asilata. Is it correct? That is correct. Number four. Ma Kataba Faisalul Ajbi Bata. Lianna kalama hu kalama hu maksurun. Okay, translate, brother and sisters. He did not write the answers because his pen is broken. Are you with me? So here we come, brother and sisters. Kataba ma nafi arfu nafi kataba fiel. Faisalun, file, al ajbi bata, mafulun bihi, li anna, anna min akhwatu, inna, kalama, not kalamu, but kalama, ismu anna, wa huwa mudaf, and hu mudaf ilahi, and maksurun, no, but the khabar. <laughs> Are you with me? It's, this is a nice sentence to analyze uh, in a simple way if you can. So, kalamahu, what is kalamahu? Two words. What are they? Mudaf, mudaf ilahi. Uh, kalamahu, maksurun. Kalamahu, maksurun. Okay, brothers and sisters. So, lianna, because, anna min akhwatu inna. So, it needs... Ismu inna mansub and where is that? Kalama. Wa huwa mudaf and hu mudaf ilayhi. And then we need khabar anna, brother Hassan. And khabar anna is maksurun. Okay. Inshallah. Ta'ammalil amsilata la atiyata. Ponder the following examples. Al-Qur'anu. What is Al-Qur'anu, brothers and sisters? Al-Qur'anu. Marfu. It's Marfu. Huh? Al-Qur'anu. What is it? Marfu. You see a Dhamma there. Now I have a sentence here, which is, Qara'at Talibul Qur'ana. So what is Qara'a? Fiyal. Where is the file? Atalibu. And what is Al-Qur'ana? Mafulun bihi. Got the idea? Very beautiful example. Next one. Al-Kahwatu. Shariba adaifu al-Kahwata. Shariba al-Daifu al-Kahwata. Where is the verb, brother? Shariba. Where is the file? Daifa. And where is Mafulun bihi? Kahwata. See? Huh? Always. Uh, see, this is the first time now we are coming across Mansu form in wholesale. <laughs> but then they are coming in wholesale now. They will come from everywhere now. See, that is, again I emphasize the beauty of Dr. Abdurrahim's book. We were not introduced to this in book one and not up to lesson five. Now we are introduced and it will come in every sentence, more or less. Okay? Adarsu. Adarsu. See, marfu. 
Katabal Mudarrisud Darsa. The teacher wrote the lesson. Okay. Al Babu Fatahat Aminatul Baba. Fatahat Aminatul Baba. So where is the verb? Fataha. If you say Fatahat, then no, but the, the verb is Fataha. Then we have a Tautani see, that tells us that the doer of the action was a feminine. And then where is the file? Aminatu. Okay. And then what is Al Baba? Mafulun bihi. Inshallah. But this now gives you a lot of uh, you know, access to the sentences in the Quran now. Inshallah. Now the point is this, brother. I had told you long time ago. The sequence of verbal sentence. What is the sequence of verbal sentence? Normally, there can be exceptions. Fial, file, and mafulun bihi. That is the sequence. Now when the mafulun bihi is in the form of a pronoun, then it is joined with the verb. Then it is fial, mafulun bihi, and file. Only if it is a pronoun. Otherwise not. Otherwise, you will see it comes later. But there can be exceptions, brother and sister. Okay. So, here is a Qara'a Talibu. Ask a question. You will get the answer. The student read. Read what? You get the answer. When you get the answer, it means the verb is transitive. What is the Arabic for transitive? Al-Mut'addi. Al-Mut'addi. Inshallah, slowly, slowly. You will uh, uh, master it, and if you don't remember, uh, don't worry, don't worry. Okay. Shariba daifu. Daifu is the guest. The guest drank. Ask a question. Drank what? You get the answer. That he drank coffee. So coffee is your mafulun bihi. Katabal mudarisu. Mudaris wrote. Ask a question. What is the question? Wrote what? And then you get the answer. Adarsa. That is your mafurun bihi. Fatahat aminatu. Amina opened. Ask a question. What is the question? Open what? You get the answer. When you get the answer, it is mafurun bihi. Jalasat aminatu. Ask a question. <laughs> she said, said what? No, no, no. It doesn't, doesn't fit here. You know, it means that verb is a intransitive. It does not need a full unbi. Once again, I repeat, in all of book one, we had four verbs. Zahaba, Kharaja, Jalasa, Raja. They were all intransitive. That was a deliberate planning of Dr. Abdul Rahim. Not to bring transitive verbs. If he had brought transitive verbs, then he has to explain mafulun bihi. But he waited till lesson number five in book two to introduce mafulun bihi. So that's very wonderful, a very beautiful. Because in other books, brothers and sisters, all these things will come right in the beginning, and it is confusing. Some you don't know where to give dhamma, where to give fata, it causes a lot of confusion. But in this. Uh, Dr. Abdurrahim's books, things are step by step. And now, from now onwards, keep your eyes open for Mafulun Bihi. Okay. So, Qara'at Talibu al Qur'ana. Qara'at Talibu al Qur'ana. But the Talibu is file, and al Qur'an is very easy now for us. Huh? No difficulty here. Ayjin. What is the meaning of Ayjin? Specify. Huh? File and mafulun bihi fi jumale laatiyati in the following sentences. Da. Da means put. Khattan wahidan tahta file. Put one line under the file. Wa khattaini. There is two lines. Tahtal mafulu bihi. Washkel. And vowelize. 
Akhira Kulla Minha. Okay? And Wawa lies every uh, file and mafulun bihi. Brother? Sister Hafsa, read the first sentence and put, give the proper vowel signs. Kasarat teflu al kalama. See now, can you see kasara? Teflu, the child broke. Broke what? You can see, you can ask a question and you get an answer. So, kasara is your verb and a teflu marfu is your file. And then mafulun bihi has to be mansu. Are you with me? See, now you will vowelize it properly. Kalama. Kasarat teflu al kalama. Sister Sumaya. Mindila, mashallah, mashallah. Gasalat aminatu al mindila. So, where is the file? Aminatu. Huh? Because in this, we are specifying, putting one line under file and two lines under mafulun bihi. But gasala is your fail, tau, tanisi, and then aminatu is your file, and mindila is your mafulun bihi. Sister Naima, akala, usama, usama tu, file, huh? and then inaba. Inaba. Huh? Great. Huh? So Inaba is your mafulun bihi. Usama tu is your file. So you can put one line under Usama and two lines under Inaba. Wa akalat. And what is the next word? Zaujatu hu. Zaujatu hu. What kind of a compound is this? Mudaf mudafili. So first, Zawjatu is the file, wa huwa mudaf, and hu mudafili. Got the idea? And is there a mafulun bihi? What is the mafulun bihi? Al mauza, mashallah, mashallah. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. Sister Sukhaina? Sharibatil bakaratu al ma'a. Now, why do you say sharibatil? Because there are two sukuns. Huh? Brothers and sisters, look at this. It comes in the lesson later on. Shariba ta. And then Al Bakara tu. Are you with me? Sharibat Sharibat Al Bakara tu. Now because this is Hamdatul Wasal, I cannot pronounce it. Huh? Because there is something in front of it. There is a word in front of it. Now, here is a sukun, and lam has a sukun, so there are two sukuns. And you cannot pronounce them. Two sukuns cannot be pronounced. We call it iltikai sakinaini, meeting of two sukuns. Now, in order to pronounce them, The, the first sukun will always get a kasra, temporary. Now pronounce. Sharibatil, huh? then you can, from T you can go to Al. Now you can pronounce them, brother. Are you with me? So that is what it is. Huh? Now in, in Quran this comes, and those who do not know language, they will never know why Kasra came. Hmm? And we know that this Kasra is not original. It is a temporary thing. It was used to, it was used to pronounce the word properly. Are you with me? So Tao Tanis is still there. Now, you, when they give you Kasra, they don't put Sukun in the Quran. So you will read Sharibatil Bakratu and you will have no idea what is this Sharibati. <laughs> you have no idea. But with the knowledge of language, you know that it is temporary. That is Tao Tanisi with a Sukun. 
Huh? And we give it a kasra so that we can now join uh, two words together. Sister Arifa? Huh? Ah, very nice sentence. Hafiza Hamzatul Qur'ana. Where is the file? Sister Arifa? Hamzatul. Oh, what is this Al Qur'ana doing here? Mafulun bihi. Because ask a question, no? Hafiza Hamza tu. Hamza memorized. Memorize what? You get the answer. Al Quran. And that is your Mafulun bihi. No, I am only doing this for you to understand that there is a way of finding Mafulun bihi. But you will become so strong that you will be able to identify it without any difficulty, brothers and sisters. Okay? Now, Sister Aisha, Darabat Fatima tu Bintaha, Mashallah, Mashallah. Huh? See, Bintaha is a compound. How many words are there? What, are, what is the compound? Mudaf, Mudafilehi. Got the idea? How will you analyze it now? Sister Aisha, Daraba, Fiel. Ta, tau, ta, nisi. Where is the file? Ah, minatu. Where is mafulun bihi? Binta. Wahua, mudaf, and ha, mudaf ilahi. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? MashaAllah, that is excellent. So here, darabat came. Huh? Properly, darabat came. There is no need to give kasra. Because the next word doesn't start with sukun. But if it was al, uh, then we would have put a, suku, put a kasra there, you know, in Darabati. Okay. Inshallah, more example will come. Sister Ramuna? Ha, ah, mashallah. Where is the fiel? Katala. Where is the file? And where is the mafulun bihi? And bil hajri? Jahan majru. Khalas. Huh? Mashallah. Okay, brothers and sisters. This is a very funny thing. I always tell in the class, from now onwards, see how many snakes are being killed in the book. Okay, you will count huh, now. This is snack number one. What is it, brother? Keep your count. Huh? We had a young fellow last time in our class, Brother Kazim. He got a... He got a Nickname, Kazim Dynamite. Because he was very brilliant. He was only 12 years old. But mashallah, mashallah, he, he was very brilliant. And he did book through all the things. And his parents uh, took uh, him out of the school for one year. And he completed the course. Now he's back to his normal schooling. But he was very, very sharp. So he used to keep count. I said, Kazim, how many snakes are now? <laughs> so here it is our first snake, brother. Sister uh, uh, Nasreen, Samia Bilalun, that is your file. Al Azana, Wa Zahaba Il Al Masjidi, MashaAllah. Now we are going to figure out here. Samia, Fiel, Bilalun is file, Mashallah, and then what is Wa, Ataf, and then Fiel, where is the file? Mashallah, it Mustatir, and then you will say, Takdiruhu Huwa, and then we will say in Arabic, Yadullu ala, I will write down, huh? Ya dullu ala. Do not be, you know, gabrified with ya dullu ala. Dalla ya dullu. We are going to study this verb later on. Means it is pointing. Pointing to what? Zahaba. The file in Zahaba points to what? Bilal. So you will say, ya dullu ala bilalin. 
What will you say? Yadullu ala bilalin. Why bilalin? Harf jar isam majroor. Yadullu ala. I will take, write down here. B la lin. This is how we'll say. I'll repeat and we'll be repeating. Zahaba fiel fail damirun mustatirun. Taqdiruhu huwa. Yadullu ala and whatever the case is, inshallah. And then, Ilal Masjidi, Jar Majru. Very good. Sister uh, Mainaz. MashaAllah. Kataba. What is Kataba? And Al Mudarisu. Ask a question. Mudaris wrote. Wrote. What? And you get the answer. Huh? So, dar sa It cannot be dar si it cannot be dar su It has to be dar sa Mafulun bihi, always, always mansu. Okay? Kataw al mudarisu dar sa ala saburati. What is ala saburati? Jar mansu. Fine. Nam, sister Nusrat. Yes. Saminati. Fine. Where is the verb? Where is the file? Al Bakalu, the green grocer. Bakalu, green grocer. Fataha Bakalu. Where is Mafulun Bihi? Adukana. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Fine. Fi Asati Isam Majru. And what is Thaminati? Naat. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. At uh, 8 o'clock. Huh? He opened the bakkal, the green grocer opened the shop at 8 o'clock. Very good. Brother number 5. It is very beautiful exercise, but now it requires thinking. Now it requires more vocab from you. Okay? Akmil, complete Al Jumla Latiata Bi Kalimatin Muna Sibatin Wad the Wad the Bitha Bi Shakli means, brothers and sisters, that you vowelize it. Okay? You vowel put proper vowel signs on it, you know. Vowelize it properly, brother. Man Fataha al bab man fataha al bab you can also say man fataha al al kitab man fataha al kitab for anything you can say huh? okay you got the idea fine okay now we come to brother hasan number 2 gasalat mashallah gasalat Ukhti Al-Mindi La, mashallah, mashallah Gasalat Ukhti Al-Mindi La, mafulun bihi So where is the verb? Gasala only And then there is a Tau Tanishi Where is the file? Ukhti is two words Mudaf Mudaf ilayhi So where is the file? Ukhtu Wahuwa mudaf and ya mutakalim mudaf. You got the idea? Huh? You, when you see mudaf mudaf ilay, then you got to separate them and say the thing which is file. Huh? Are you with me, Sister Afza? Sister Sumaya, you understand, inshallah? Very good. Okay, brother. Other uh, uh, Abdul Samad? Bil asa. Stick. Danda. Okay, brother and sister. Snack number two. <laughs> are, you, are you counting? I should not remind you. You should count. Katala rajulul hayata bil asa. So what is the katala? Fiel a rajulul file al hayata mafulun. Bil asa jar majulun. Brother Muhammad. Shariba. Uh-huh. Yusufa al-Qahwa. Why will you say Yusufa? 
Shariba Yusufu. Why would you say fa? No, there's no reason. It has to be fu. Why fu? Why fu and not fi and not fa? Because it is a file. And file is always marfu. Marfu. File is always marfu. Remember, brothers and sisters, if you make a little error here and there, don't worry. <laughs> Mafulun bihi will come later. Huh? But then if we make a mistake, we are all human beings. Huh? Uh, we are learning. We are bound to make some mistakes. Uh, you should not be, you know, you should not blame yourself. You know, just we learn from our mistakes and make ourselves more perfect. Very good, Sister Afsa. Yes. Saburati, Masha. This is easy. Katabal Mudarisu Darsa. Now you see, if you read your lessons very well, all the answers will come to you. They will be on your fingertips if you read the lesson very well. Okay? Now number six. Suada is is a Suada is a sister's name. Huh? So Sumaya, what will you say? Khubza. What is Khubz? Bread. Okay. What will you say? Will she drink or will she eat the bread? Akala. What would you say now? You say feminine. Akalat. What will you say? Akalat. Why would you say akalat? Because the file is muannas. Suad is akalat suadu al khubza. Suadu al khubza. Got the idea? Translation, swan ate the bread. Huh? Fine. Sister Fatima, do you think you can handle it? Karatu, I read. Read what? al darsa Al-Kitaba, al Qurana, anything you want to say. Karatu, al darsa I read the lesson. Karatu, Al-Qurana, I read the Quran. Karatu, I read. Read what? You need an answer. And that answer is your mafulun bihi. Mashallah. Sister Naima. <coughs> what will you say? Samayatu? Then you are asking yourself. Asamiyata. Asamiyata. Al-Azana. Ya Hamza. Did you, how will you translate? Asanti. So asamiyata. So samiy. Huh? Samiy. Where is the verb, brother? Samiy. Huh? With a sukun. Remember, this is your verb. Samiy ta. And then alaza na. Sahi, brother and sister. Very good. Sister Sukhaina. Fatahat tajiru dukkana. Mashallah, that was very good. Tajiru is your file. Dukan is your mafulun bihi. Now, sister Arifa. Huh? What did you say? Kharajat tullabu. So what is the verb? Kharaja. Where is the file? Tullabu. Huh? And then, minal. Firstly, what kind of a verb is this? It is lazim. Huh? Says Arifa, it does not need mafulun. Try to ask a question. Kharaja Tullabu. Tullabu went out. Ask say, went out what? <laughs> you don't get the answer. So this is fair lazim. Intransitive. Okay? Masha'Allah. Ij al kullan min al kalimati la atiyati mafulun bihi. What the bit? Akhiraha. Okay. Brothers and sisters, Ij'al, make. Huh? All the following words into mafulun bihi and vowelize it. The end of it. So you'll have to make a new sentence. Uh, whose turn is now? Sister Aisha. Make a nice sentence in which you can use Quran as mafulun bihi. Mashallah. See, karatu al Quran. So, where is the verb, sister Aisha? Kara. 
with no, not two. Two is your five. Kara with sukun. Remember, it's not kara but kara. Are you with me? When you write down, where is the verb? Kara with sukun. That is your verb. Okay, and what is two? Five. And then where is the mafulun bihi? Al Qur'an na. Are you with me, brother and sister? Karatul Quran. Translation, sister Aisha. I read the Quran. See now things are getting more interesting. You are using your mafulun being and understanding it, inshallah. Sister Maimuna, kahwatu. Sharibtu kahwata, mashallah. Sharibtu kahwata. Or you can say, Shariba hamidun kahwata, whatever you want to say. But that was your sentence, absolutely correct. Where is the verb? Sharib. Only sharib with sukun. Huh? Okay, and two is the five. Sister Nasreen, Tufahu. Yeah, what did you say? Akala atufaha. Translation? Mashallah. See? Akala tufaha. He ate the apple. Akal tu ayat. But when you say akala tufaha, he ate the apple. Where is the file? Where is the file? Mustate. Takadiruhu huwa kalas. Sister Mayras. Fatahtul Baba. I opened the door. Or you can say, you can change the file. Instead of we saying two, two, two all the time, you can say, Fatahat Aminatu al Baba. Or Fataha al Waladu. Al-Baba, the boy opened the door. Something, you know, you have a choice. But when you say Fatahtu al-Baba, it's absolutely correct. Nusrat? Huh? Uh, you are asking, or she's asking a question. Afahinta darsa What is the translation? Did you understand the lesson? Mashallah. Afahinta darsa Mashallah, mashallah. Where is the fiel? Fahim, with sukun. Where is the file? Ta. And where is mafulun bihi? Darsa. Mashallah, mashallah. Brother Hassan. Al-Kami. Mashallah, mashallah. Gasalat ummi al-Kamisa. Translation, brother? Mashallah, beautiful tea. My mother washed the shirt. Where is the uh, uh, fiel? Where is the word? Gasala. And what is the next thing? Tautanisi. Tautanisi. Where is the file? Ummu. Ummi is two words. Ummi is compound. And what kind of a compound is this? Mudaf. So if we have to choose one of the word as a file, okay? So what is the file? Where is the file? Ummu. Wahua. Mudaf. And then, Ya Mutakallam. Mudaf. And Al-Kami. Sa. Maf'ulun bihi. MashaAllah. MashaAllah. I think we will take a short break. Brothers and sisters, we start now. Now we are learning another very, very important rule, brothers and sisters. So I will write down something on the board, huh, brother? Okay. What did I say, brothers and sisters? At-Talibu. At-Talibu. Zahaba. Ilal. Fasli. Translation? Classroom. What is the Talibu, brother and sister? Mubtada. Where is the khabar? Jumla Felia is the khabar. Al Jumla Tul Felitu is the khabar. Fine, brother. Yeah. 
If I say at-talibu, mubtada, then what is zahaba? Fial. Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdiruhu huwa. Yadullu ala talib. It is pointing out to, indicating it to the talib. Now I say at-talibani. So what does, does it now means? Two students. Atalibani is now Muftada. Is it Marfu? Yes. yes. What is the sign of its Marfu? Alif, mashallah. Why? Because it is dual. Okay. And then I have to put a proper verb. Are you with me? So, Zahaba. Okay. Where is the verb? Zahaba. Where is the file? Alif, mashallah. Huh? Now I say to you, At-Tullabu Zahabu Ilal Fasli. What is At-Tullabu? Mubtada. Where is the khabar? Jumla failure. What is Zahabu? Zahabu without wow is your fial. And where is the file? Wow. Huh? See, this is your fial. And this is your file. I should not do this way. And then I keep the alif outside. Okay. By the way, what is this alif? Now I can explain you. What is noon? Noonu vikaya. What is this alif? Alif vikaya. It protects the vow. See, before I, we could not go in detail. Now this is alif vikaya. Huh? It protects the verb, okay? Wow, especially wow. Okay, brother, atullabu. What is atullabu? Mabtada. Where is the news? Zahabu ilal fasli. So that is your jumla failure coming as a khabar. Where is the verb? Zahabu, without wow. And where is the file? Al wow. Now you see, when the mubtada starts, then you bring an appropriate word form to match the muftada. Huh? Okay? Fine. Now we change it, brother. So I say to you, Zahaba, Zahaba, Talibu, Ilal, Fasli. What kind of a sentence is this now? What was what kind of a sentence was this? Jumla ismiya. Huh? Now we start straight away. Jumla filia. Where is the verb? Where is the file? Talibu. Huh? Now I have to say here. Tali bani. Two students are going. Now what kind of a verb I use? Huh? Shall I say zahaba? Because there are two students? No, I will still say Zahaba. What happened if I said Zahaba Atalibani? Uh, if I say Zahaba, then there is a file in Aleph, there is a file as an Aleph, and there is a file here. How can you have two files? So we have to use a singular verb. Okay? Now we say at tullabu What kind of verb shall I use? What form of verb? Against Zahaba. Okay? Many of you will be tempted to say Zahabu at tullabu What you will be tempted. Uh, because you say it's a, it's a jama, so I use use jama. If you say zahabu, atullabu, brothers and sisters, you got a file here, and you got a file here. You can't have two files in a sentence. So, what do we understand out of it? We understand out of it that if you start a new sentence. What did I say? 
you start a brand new sentence and if the verb is in third person what kind of a verb is in third person brother huwa huma hum hiya huma hunna these are third person okay okay and all of them have a verb forms okay zahaba zahaba zahabu zahabat zahabata zahabna okay but if you start a fresh sentence uh, and if the file is third person third person ha huwa huma hu ye huma hunna okay then the verb is always singular did you get it see here zahaba talibu zahaba talibani zahaba tullabu the verb is singular only in the beginning of a new sentence ha huh? same change it now zahaba zahabat atalibatu zahabat atalibatani zahabat atalibatu are you with me make it more nice you want me to write it yes. i will write it ha huh? okay okay i will say here zahabat at tali batu and then i will say zahabat at tali batani now mind you, you you will have to say zahabat at tali batu are you with me zahabat at tali you you know that huh? you know that huh? okay zaha bat at tali batu are you with me man so what is the rule that you start a new sentence and if the file happens to be gaib in third person ha huh? then whether it is singular dual or plural you will use the verb in the first form in the singular form huh? and then if you have to say more things about that file then you will use an appropriate form okay so here is huh? the student went to the class and sat what did i say the student went to the class and sat okay uh i i just have to now remove this huh? zahaba talibu ila al fasli و جلس now you come to ذهب الطالبان الى الفصل و جلس now you will use the proper verb و جل سا ذهب الطلاب الى الفصل و jalasu because now we have to use the proper verb form wa jala su now change that brother zahabat ha huh? maybe i should write down here brother and sisters in order to make it very clear ha huh? zahabat talibatu are you with me zahabat 
Atali ba tahani. And then I write down here. Zahabat atali ba tu. Now, what will happen here, brother? Zahabat atali ba tu. Then I will say wa jala sat. Jala sat. Now, if I say zahabat atalibah tani wa jalasata what do i say wa jalasata are you with me brothers and sisters now you say zahabat atali batu wa jalasna wa jalasna is it clear, brother and sister? This will happen, are you listening to me, brother and sisters? This will happen only in third person. That's all. In a third person, when you start a new sentence, you will always start with a singular verb. Mudakar or Muannas. That's it. Mudakar or Muannas. Always. And then, afterwards, when you continue, then you will use the proper form, referring to the file before. Referring to the file before. See? Zahabat talibatu. So it's a singular. Huh? So you say, jalasat. You will say, jalasat. Okay? Now you say, zahabat a talibatani. And then, now you will look at this and you say, Jalasata. Now you say, Zahabat, singular, Muannas. Zahabat, a talibatu. And then you will say, Wa. You will look at this and use the word Jalasna. Let's go to Muzakkar. Zahabat, talibu. Wa. Jalas. I look at this file and use the word. Zahabat Talibani wa Jalasa. Now Jalasa refers to Talibani. Zahabat Tullabu wa Jalasu. See, here singular and there the appropriate verb to match the file, you know which was before. Are you with me, brother and sister? Sister Nasri? Inshallah. Uh, brother and sisters, it is easy to understand and it is easy to forget. Huh? And what will make you very strong? When you will write it. Huh? When you will write it, it will make you strong. Warna, we understand and tomorrow we forget. Huh? But if you write it, Inshallah, you will master it. One more time. It is only for third person. Whether it is Muzakkar or Muannas, when you start a new sentence, the first verb form is singular. Only when you start a new sentence. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now, here is number seven. Tamal Musalaini Atiyaini. Okay? Ponder the following two examples. Atullabu, see Mubtada. What is Tullabu? Mubtada. Now you got to have appropriate verb. Zahabu ilal malabi. Fine. Under. Change that to Jumla Felia. You will start with a Zahaba, not Zahabu. Zahabat Tullabu. If you started with Zahabu, you will end up with having two files. And you can't have that. Okay? Inshallah. Now, Atalibatu. What is it, brother and sisters? Atalibatu. Zahabna. What is the Talibatu? Muftada. Zahabna. 
Are you with me, brother and sisters? Now change it, brother, into jumla failure. You will have to say, Zahabat atalibatu. Zahabat atalibatu. Did you understand the rule, brother and sisters? Inshallah. It's not difficult. One more time I repeat. It is for third person. You will start with a singular verb. Huh? Fine. <clears throat> now number eight. Kaddimil fiala. You know, bring the fiel forward. Okay? See, al-awladu sharibu kahvata. Where is the verb? Sharibu. Now bring it forward. In other words, this is a jumla ismiya. Change it into jumla failure with the same file. You know, okay? With the same meaning in the sentence. So what it happened? Shariba al-awladu. Shariba al-awladu kahwa. Did you get the idea? Huh? Sister Halima, you are going to start the sentence. An-nasu sami'u azana. Bring the word forward. What will you say now? Mashallah, beautiful. Huh? You got the idea, brothers and sisters? So where is the file now? Samia and Nasu. Nasu is the file. But in the previous sentence, where was the file? Wow. Where was the file? Wow. Huh? Okay. Uh, sister uh, Arifa, change it, sister. Atullabu katabul ajbi bata. Mafulun bees are there, huh? Remember, how will you change that? Bring the fiel forward? MashaAllah. Brother, this is, what, what is all this? <laughs> this is easy. You know why it is easy? Because you are strong. You worked hard and you became strong in your verbs. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. See, now you can see the fruits of our doing the verbs in advance. Huh? Okay. Sister Aisha. Dakhalat. MashaAllah. Because it is muannas. Dakhalat tit talibatu. What would you say? Dakhalat tit talibatu fasla. MashaAllah. Next one, Sister Maimuna. What will you say? Karajal mudari suna min al fasli. Very good. Sister Nasreen. MashaAllah. Raja'a jumalai min makkata. Very good. Sister Mainaz. Kumsana. Yeah. No, no, no. No, no. She can, when she washes, she can wash one shirt, or ten shirts, or fifty shirts, or hundred shirts. Still she is washing. That will not, mafulun we will have no effect. So what will you say, sister? Akhawati. Where is the file? If you say gasalat, where is the file? Akhawatu. File is always marfu. When you say akhawati, what kind of a compound is this? Mudaf, mudaf ilayhi. Sahih? So where is our file? Mudaf. Which is akhawa tu. It became ti because of ya mutakallim. So remember. Huh? So you will say, gasalat, gasala is fiel, tahu tanisi, and file is akhawa tu, wa huwa mudaf, and then ya mutakallim, mudaf ilayhi, and al kumsa na, mafulun bihi. Got the idea? You will have to write all of them. If you write this, you'll become very strong. Then you won't forget, inshallah. Fine. Now, you have to also remember one thing. When you say, akhawati, what is akhawati? Mubtada. What is mubtada? Akhawatu. Wa huwa mudaf. And then, ya mutakallam, 
mudafili. And where is the khabar? Gasalna. What is it? Gasalna. Where is the file? Where is the verb? Gasal. Where is the file? Nunu niswa. But na, correct. But what is na? Nunu niswa. That is your file. Mashallah. Nusrat. The kakina, the kakina, yes. Mashallah. Fatahat to charu the kakina. Got the idea? Very good. Uh, Sister Sumaya. Mashallah. Zahabat. How, how will you say? Zahabatit. Huh? Remember. Zahabatit. Tabibatu. Ilal Mustashwa. Very good. Okay. Sister Fatima. Mashallah. Fahimatullabu Darsa. Fahimatullabu Zarsa. Very good. That was excellent. Huh? Brothers and sisters, now what we had done a little while ago on the board, now we are doing it now. Look at it. Kharajatullabu wa zahabu. See, here comes kharaja and then comes zahabu. Kharaja because we started a new sentence. So we got to use the verb in the first form, the base form. Remember the base form, which is huwa or it can be here. Okay? And then zahabu has to ma- match tullabu. Okay? So what is the next one, brother? Kara'atullabu wa katabu. Translation, brother. Kara'atullabu wa katabu. The students read and they wrote. And they wrote. Huh? And they wrote. Very good. Next one. Akalan nasu wa sharibu. People ate and they drank. Okay, are you with me? Did you see? Now we have to kavin. Huh? Change the sentences according to the examples which came before you in the tamreen. Use the, the words between the brackets. Whose turn is Naima? What will you say? Dakhalat tullabu al fasla. Remember, Dakhala has a mafulun bihi. Dakhalat tullabu al fasla. Wa jala su. Got the idea? The students entered the classroom and sat. Huh? Uh, whose turn is now? Sister Sukhaina. Oh, again the snack has come. Number? Number three. But then you've got to count, huh? We'll end up having dozens <laughs> by the time we finish book two, okay? Okay. al <laughs> awladu al hayyata again mafulun bihi wa wa katalu ha again you have to use mafulun bihi wa katalu ha. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? You want me to write it? Are you are okay? Write it? Inshallah I will write it. Huh? Huh? Brother and sisters? Darabal Auladu Al Hayata. Darabal Auladu Al Hayata. Wa. Now I have to use verb which is Matches to our ladu. Katalu. Katalu. And then I'll put ha. Okay, I went right at the end. Okay? Wa katalu ha. Look at katalu ha. Where is the verb? Katalu. It's dhamma. Where is the file? Al wow. And then what is ha? Mafulun bihi. Where does ha go to? Hayata. Huh? Where does that wow go to? 
الاولاد صحیح اس کے لیے انشاءاللہ وستانیس تاو سسرا حفصہ فاہیمو فاہیمو ہو بکاز یو ہیو ٹو فاہیمو نی ول نیڈ مفول ان بیری و Is it Kara'a? Kara'atul Labu Ad-Darsa Wa Fahimuhu Darsa is Muzakkar Fahimuhu Sahih And they understood it They understood it. Very good. Now, Brother Muhammad. Sami'a al-Nasu al-Azan al-Masjidi wa Zahabu. Now, here we'll have to no, you, your attempt was good. Sami'a al-Nasu al-Azana al-Azana khalas. Because see, al-Azana and al-Masjidi, they are both Definite, so we cannot make it mudaf mudafili. And azan is always from the masjid. So what will you say? Sami an nasul azana wa zahabu ilal masjidi. Wa zahabu ilal masjidi. Got the idea? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Brothers and sisters, we got here kawwin jumlan mustamilan. الكلمات التي أتاه. Fine, brother. Use the following, you know, verbs in a nice sentences. Okay, brother. Make simple sentence. You can use madi, mudaria, anything you want. Huh? Any form you want. Okay. You got fourteen forms to use. Akala, he ate. Oh, how will you say? Yes. Al Khubz. Al Khubz. Khubz. I want the proper vowel sign at the end. Al Khubz. Za. Yes. Brother Hassan, we got to put the proper vowel sign. Akala. Akala al Waladu al Khubza. Now you, you can also could have said Akal tu Khubza. Any, any form which has the, this thing. Fine. Brother. Uh, Uh, Abdul Samad, Gasala. Uh, uh, yeah. Then he washed the shirt. Yeah. If you say Gasala al Kamisa, then he washed the shirt. If you want to say I washed the shirt, Tasaltu Kamisa. If you say my 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 wife washed the shirt, Gasalat Zaujati. What will you say? Gasalat Zaujati al Kamisa. Then my wife. Wash the shirt. Got the idea, brother? Inshallah. Okay, Sister Harima. Kara'a. Kara'a tullabu darsa. Mashallah. See, verb was singular, but the file was plural. Kara'a tullabu darsa. Okay. Sister Arifa. Kataba. Yes. Kataba al mudarisu darsa ala saburati. Huh? The teacher wrote the lesson on the breakboard. Katab al mudarisu adar sa. But then now, when you see a verb which is transitive, you got to have a mafulun bihi. And mafulun bihi is always mansub. We got to remember that. Huh? We cannot make mistakes there, inshallah. Okay. Sister Aisha Daraba. Darabal auladu. Oh. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Al hayya. Okay. Hayyata. Okay. Ah. Okay, sister. Uh, Mamuna. Katala rajulu. Al hayvana. An animal. Yes, that's correct. Katala rajulu haywana. 
فاین برادر داخل سسٹر نسرین داخل رجل دکانا دکانا سی اگین دکانا مفول بھی ویری گڈ سسٹر مہناس خالجت اللہ ابو من الفاس ماشاء اللہ حفیظہ سورت سورت یاسین سورت یاسین ماشاء اللہ حفیظ تو سورت حفیظ فیل تو فائل سورت مفولن بھی وہو مداف ان یاسین مداف لہی ماشاء اللہ اوکے سسٹر سمیہ شریبہ ماشاءاللہ نام فاہم تو ہو فاہم تو ہو دیٹس آل اور یو کین سے فاہم تو درسا جائی دن فاہم تو درسا جائی دن اور از دا ٹرانسلیشن آئی انڈرسٹوڈ دا لیسن ویری ویل فاہم تو درسا جائی دن کار دا آئیڈیا اوکے لیٹ می رائٹ پر دا فاہم تو درسا فہم تو ویر از دا ورب فہم واٹ از تو فائل واٹ از دا درس اینڈ واٹ از جائی دن مفول مطلق واٹ از اٹ مفول مطلق اوکے سی جائی دن ڈز ناٹ ہیو ال سو اٹ کین ناٹ بی ناتھ ٹو درس Now, if I say, فَهِمْ تُو دَرْسَ الْجَدِيدَةِ Then, الْجَدِيدَةِ will become the Naat. I understood the new lesson. But here is, I understood the lesson very well. So, جَعِيدًا is مَفُولٌ مُطْلَقْ We will be dealing with that soon. But I just want to hit you with that thing, مَفُولٌ مُطْلَقْ So, you will remain alert, inshallah. ماشاء اللہ سسٹر نعیمہ سمیہ ازانہ what is the translation you heard the ازان then you will have to say سمیہ تو when you say سمیہ الازانہ translation brother and sister he heard the ازان very good see now you are all getting sharp الحمدللہ you do not know how much pleasure I happiness I feel in my heart when you really translate it properly. See, it, it means now finally the, the verbs, uh, you know, is, is being understood very well. So when you say, Samiya al-Azana, sentence is correct. But if you say, I heard the Azan, that is wrong. Samiya al-Azana, Samiya, he heard. So where is the file? Mustatir, taqdiru huwa. He heard the azan. But if you want to say, I heard the azan, then you will say, Samiyatu al-azana. Samiyatu al-azana. Okay, inshallah. Very good, brother. Number 11 is very simple, brother. Man fatah al-baba. Ana fatah tuhu, brother. So what is fatah plus tu plus hu? We have analyzed it so many times. Fatah, fiel, tu, file, and who is? Mafulun bihi. Man fatahan nawafiza. Who opened the windows? Ana fatah tu ha. Because it is nawafiza. Kullu jama muannas. Okay. Al kalimatul jadida tu. Al inabu. You know the meaning? Grape. Al mauzu. Banana. Atinu. الفجر دون الفجر الفجر جواب اجبیبت نو یو ریمبر پلورلس 
سوالون از ایلتون نو یول میمورایش دیس انشاءالله یول میمورایش دیس البقالو دا گرین گروسر الاسا دا ستک حیتون سنیک what is the jama? Hayatun. Very good. Samia. He heard. Huh? And Fahima. And Shariba. Yeah. What kind of a verb is this, brother and sister? Bob wise. Bob wise. Samia. Yasma. Huh? So the Kasra change into Fata. Are you with me? Samia. Yes, ma'u. Write down under it, yes, ma'u. Huh? And Fahima, Fahima, when you see Kasra, 99% of the time, it will be turned into Fatah. Huh? Are you with me, brother? Abdul Samad? When you see Kasra, when you make Mudariya, make it into Fatah 99% of the time. Or maybe make it 99 point. Nine percent of the time, brother. Samia Mudaria, yes, no, no. We are not supposed to do Mudaria, but we are preparing ourselves. Fahima, yafhamu. Shariba, yashrabu. Got the idea? What bab is this? When you change kasra into fata in Mudaria, what bab is this? Bab Samia. Daraba, you change fata into kasra. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready, brothers and sisters? Fatuho dam min nasarayan sur. Fatuho kasarin daraba yadribu. See, fata change into kasra. Fatuho kasarin daraba yadribu. Fatahatani, fatahatani, fataha. Yaftahu. Dammo dammin karuma. Yakrumu. Twice damma damma. Damma here in the Mahdi. Damma here on the... In Mudariya. But on Ayn Kalima. Dammo dammin karuma. Yakrumu. Kasro fatahin. Kasro fatahin. Samia yasma. We say the name of the Baab. Uh, because we will always refer to it as Bab Samia. Samia Yasma. Kasaratani Jiha. Kasaratani. What is that? Hasiba Yasibu. Hasiba. This is a nice poem, brother. It is in the books. Okay? I did not make this. It is already in the grammar books. Okay? Fatuho Dammin. Nasarayan suru Fatuho kasarin Darabayadribu Fatahatani Oh yes! Fatahatani Fataha yaftahu Remember this. This is a nice poetry, brother. And I, if I tell you Fataho dammin, Fataho kasarin Then it is rukha rukha. There is no flavor in it. <laughs> okay? It will not have an impact. Uh, but when you say it in a melody and you hear it, inshallah it will, it will stay with you. <laughs>